never seen this many people in the fucking post office. Crunchyga. Already know we had to get some some new tires for the road trip. Yeah, hella tires in the mower. That's crazy. It just sits on that little thing right there. Yo, I just spent some. I just spent thirteen hundred dollars on some tires, bro. Yo, these Germans, bro. These Germans got, bro. They got motherfucking like, bro. Are tires really this expensive though? Like on, on any other car, are tires this expensive? 1300 I mean, they do last a long time, but bro. $1,300, bro. For some tires, bro. No way though. That's crazy to me. She look good though. She do look good, but I don't know. I don't think we, I don't know if we getting rid of her, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Like, like the rims looking, you know what I'm saying? No, but look at this though. Honestly, I don't know how to retire, like if they're bad or not. They had like last time I went to the people, they said they said it was a um my tire was at like a one and like that's illegal. You're supposed to have them at like I think the highest you're supposed to go, like the lowest. I don't know, because a 10 is like brand new, I think. A 10, they said a 10 is brand new. And then like a one is like horrible or something or like I, I don't know i think one was at like a four one was at a three and then there was like two out of two and then that got to a one but i don't know but motherfucker thirteen hundred dollars for this bro that's so crazy oh i also need to get my front window it don't look it looks super light on the camera but like it's really dark for some reason like at night it looks like that one but i don't know my pockets are hurt right now bro just on some tires that's why they hurt if if it wasn't like it wouldn't be that bad if it wasn't just on some tire. i could have got what could i have got with 1300 dollars? i could have got i don't know what i could have got with 1300 dollars with this car bro i went to, i was gonna see i try to put i was gonna see how i could do like if i were to uh make it a little louder <laughs> make it a little louder bro it would have literally just for that, it, he was telling me it was going to be like a band, bro. I could have straight piped it, but the straight pipe part would have sounded horrible. So I'm like, nah, I'm not going to even mess with it. It sounds good already, though. Honestly, it sounds good. I like the little, because it, it's a twin turbo, so I like the it's the, the little suction. The, and it, but yeah, bro, $1,300 on some tires, bro. You ever get a BMW, just know that like, they aren't lying when they say the maintenance is crazy. And a Mercedes, I would, I would assume, because, you know, they're... But main, uh, maintenance on a, on a BMW, bro, they treat you good, though. I'm not going to lie. They treat you good. It's not like you need tires all the time. I don't know when the last time I got tires was. But $1,300 is still crazy. I'm not going to lie. But, yeah, like, maintenance, they, aren't lying. they are not lying to you when they say the maintenance is crazy on these cars. The maintenance is not nothing to play with, bro. Not nothing to play with. Um, but yeah, I don't know. We might, we might, you know what I'm saying? We just got, whoever, whoever gets this car next, if we do get rid of it, whoever gets this car next, just got some brand new fucking tires, bro. Just got some brand new tires. Should we just go, you know what I'm saying? Should we go drift around in them? I did figure out, I didn't know this car was uh, rear wheel drive. This car is rear wheel drive. I figured it out by the, uh, the sport settings. I didn't know. I thought it was, I don't know what it was, but it is rear wheel drive. So, you know what I'm saying? We just go drift around, bro. I'm gonna mess their tires up before we give it away. I ain't gonna do that. But yeah, man, um, what else are we gonna do today? We are going on a road trip, so that's also why we need new tires. Um, it was bad. Like, the, the tire, I'm not gonna lie, the tires were pretty bad. Um, he was telling me it was damn near like illegal for me to keep driving on them. So, yeah, I, I should have got like a before. I don't know why I didn't get a before. I should have got a before on the tires so y'all can see them. But uh, yeah, bro, we are going on a road trip. So if any of y'all ladies want to go on a road trip with me, you know what I'm saying? Psych, I'm celibate. You know what I'm saying? Don't even try to pressure me. Don't even try to pressure me because I'm celibate right now. Um, anyway, we're going on a road trip. I don't know how far we're going to be. I don't know where we're going, but we're going. We're going. So y'all yeah, make sure you stay tuned for that. What else we got going on today? What else do I have to do today? I forgot. 
Oh, that's why I need to start putting stuff in my notes. Do y'all like write your schedule in your notes? Look at that El Camino, bro. Look at that little, look at that. Oh, y'all can't even see it. The big booty long, though. That thing is long in the back. But, do y'all, uh, do y'all like write your schedule in your notes? That's what I do. I write my schedule in like my notes and I like tally it down. I need to start doing that again because I forgot what I'm supposed to be doing. But yeah, we're gonna go. Let me give me a van. I might give me a van, bro. You know what I'm saying? Give me a van, dude. I always wanted that. For some reason, I always wanted, like when I was a kid, it was because of GTA. It was definitely because of GTA. But I always wanted to uh to get a van and put hydraulics on it and put like hella big speakers in the back and then just be like the the one cool motherfucker with a van but now that shit is i would not do that ever never do that but oh there i go there the little il camino go waffle barn y'all don't even know about waffle barn bro honestly they, they were hit they were hitting like crazy it was a cool little diner you know what i'm saying we, we live in a little small city so waffle barn was a cool little diner um they even had carpet. I remember that's like what place you know that's like a restaurant that got carpet, bro. That's how you know that motherfucker was old as hell. They had carpet. Okay, I'm not gonna do this. I'm gonna do some illegal shit. Okay, we got it. We got it. You know what I'm saying? And hey, my arm is hurting. My arm is hurting from filming. Goddamn. I need to get. I need to get some stronger shoulders, bro. I need to get some stronger shoulders. Where am I? Where's my steering wheel? I can't even tell where if I'm turning or not. I don't know. We have red line calibration. Right now, we don't pay to get an alignment for our tire that we just paid for. You know what I'm saying? Ain't that crazy, bro? Ain't, ain't that crazy? It costs so much to, like, live. Like, even if you broke, it costs hella to live, bro. Red line calibration. Come mess with them. I don't even know if they're good or not, so I'm just giving them a free shout-out. But, uh, yeah, you got all, you know what I'm saying? Scooby Snacks. You know what I'm saying? I can't go nowhere. I can't have my cars here, so I can't go nowhere. Got a little bit left water bottle. You know what I'm saying? That wacky site. It's that water. I need to find me like a sugar mama, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I need to find me like a sugar mama, you know what I'm saying? Cool little, cool little, you know what I'm saying? And then, dude, hey, hey, what you want, poppy? Like, Yo, I want that new, you know what I'm saying? I want that, what do I want? I want that new, um, that new PS5 controller thing, you know what I'm saying? A new PS5 thing that came out. I want that. I also want, um, I also want sweatsuits. That's really it. Oh, honestly, bro, I'd be an easy ass like person to get shit for. Cause all I want is sweatsuits. You know what I'm saying? All you gotta do is buy me sweatsuits. I'm chilling. Like I'm, I'm happy, bro. And I'm new PS5. Come on, man. Come on, man. But yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about. Come on, man. Motherfucker popping back there, yo. Oh shit. Yeah, okay. Okay, calm down, man. Calm down, man. Yo, that's tough though. I didn't even know I made pop stuff the other day when I was messing with it. I was just revving it. I was like, oh, let's make pop. You'd be like on some stock shit. On some stock shit. But um we got a lot of, we got a, those are so ugly. I'm sorry, bro. I don't, you know, I shouldn't say that because they probably bought that with their own money. But what are those called? G50s? G30s? G30s. The G30s are not cool cars to me. Some Infinities are nice, though. Some Infinities are nice, but those just ones in particular, I'm not very fond of those. I'm not going to lie. I'm not very fond of them. What y'all think about that? What is that? X3? That's a nice car right there. X3 small though like these right here i don't know they just they never look cool to me you work for it that's your car bro good for you you know what i'm saying at least you ain't riding a bike i might have to give me a bike knowing that these fucking tires god all right, all right, i'm gonna stop cussing i'm gonna stop cussing what are even kids doing like what are they doing i don't know what they doing but they doing like jumping jacks i was super nice to capture the flag too 
and now we played like a dodgeball where like you throw the ball at people it was like a it was a ball capture the fight it was their ball it was a ball but if you got the ball and you threw the ball at somebody they were out that was super nice yeah we need to find a place to, to stop and chill that was gay what the heck that was gay bro nothing to homophobes i mean homophobes homos i don't know that was definitely gay though yeah. Honda Accord, Honda Accord. Yeah, see, that's my type of ride right there. Honda Accord is my type of ride. What's good with y'all, boys? Um, right now we gotta go to the mall. Gotta go to the Galleria. Um, I gotta get some. I'm, I seen some that I like. You know what I'm saying? I see some that I like, so I'm gonna go see if I like it. And we gonna get it. You know what I mean? I also got to go Christmas shopping, so, um, yeah, got to go Christmas, it's kind of late right now though to be, because the gallery is like, it's like 45 away from where I'm at, so, and it's about to be traffic, I got to get out of here before it's traffic, because it's like 420 right now, you already know that five hour traffic, especially over, over here, bro, hell a little noise, I got to get out of here, but, um, yeah, we just going to see, I don't even know what to get nobody for Christmas this year, bro. I don't know what, honestly, bro, I love Christmas. Like, I love Christmas so much, but, like, dude, getting gifts is actually, like, a hard task, bro. Actually a hard task, because, like, Christmas is the one holiday where money is frowned upon. Like, giving somebody money is frowned upon on Christmas, I feel like. You can't give nobody money on Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Money's, you can get, like, if you give somebody money, it's like good because like on their birthday you can give them money on eat whatever it is on a, on any holiday, any other holiday. I'm trying to get this light out of my face. Any other holiday you can get them Christmas. I mean you can get them money, but on Christmas it's like frowned upon because there's no thought into giving somebody money. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, um, yeah, especially when you're around people who already got stuff that like it seems like they like. It seems like they want. I mean obviously people want everything all the time. You know what I'm saying? People always want more. But um, yeah, bro. I don't know Christmas is a is a, is a is a cool holiday, but it's also a stressful holiday. Um, we gonna see what today has in store for us. And yeah, even though today's already like it's already mid midday. I don't know. I'll see y'all later. All right. Um, I am at the mall, but this mall, the Galleria. I don't know, I got this thing now where like you can't film nothing, you can't record, you can't do none of that stuff. Last time I tried to film here, bro, they had, they had the security like on me like straight away. You know what I'm saying? He, he was over there. He ran up the escalator, all types of stuff. He ran up the escalator in front of the hose. In front of the hose, man. He ran in front of the, he ran all the way up the escalator to tell me I couldn't film. So, yeah, I'm just not gonna film, I'm not gonna provoke him today. Um, so yeah, I'm, if I get anything, I'll show y'all when I get out. I might not even get nothing, to be honest. I'm just trying to see, but I might not even get nothing, because, I don't know, what is that, what car is that? Chill out. Yo, I can't, I got no more light in here, bro. All right, y'all, as y'all can see, I purchased a beanie, you know what I'm saying? This motherfucker got ears. I don't know how I feel about the ears, bro. I don't know how I feel about the ears. I'm not really digging the ears, I ain't gonna lie. I'm about to, like, wear a hood or something with this, because... With this, it's chill, right? You know what I'm saying? Like, this is chill right here. This is light. And then and the ears pop up. God damn, them boys are loud. Hold up, though. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my gosh. Y'all hear that, bro? I think that's a Corvette. It's a Corvette. It's a nice Corvette, but now he's showing up. Um, and I also caught some cologne. I ain't telling y'all what cologne I caught, though. Y'all ain't gonna, ain't gonna get one over on me. But... Yeah, buddy over here stretching and shit. Gotta do the nice little cool back stretch. Okay, I feel him. I feel him. You know what I'm saying? It'd be like that. But yeah, cop some cologne. Um, yo, ladies out there, bro. If any ladies watch my video, bro, tell me a good perfume I should get. I need I need some suggestions. I need some suggestions. I don't know anything. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what y'all y'all fuck with. So tell me, tell me a good perfume. Um, and yeah. But yeah, man, I just, that's it, bro. They ain't really got too much in here. I'm not gonna lie. I watched this mall slowly turn to. <laughs> Why every time I try to do, every time I come to this mall, it turns, it got, it gets worse. Every time I come here, it gets worse. 
Like, this used to be the spot. The Galleria, Rose Galleria used to be the spot, bro. Like, you can find damn near anything you want. I think it's, I think it's a little bit of the, the mall just died out by itself. And it's also like times are changing, bro. Times is changing, you know what I'm saying? Everything else is a lot more complicated. Now, back then, bro, times was simple, bro. You know what I'm saying? They had the cool Nike store, they had the cool Foot Locker, Champs, you know what I'm saying? If you, all all your 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 necessities were in those stores right there, bro. You come, you know what I'm saying, right after Thanksgiving. All everything you needed, everything you were going to be excited for on Thanksgiving were in those stores. Now, bro, they got shit, but it ain't like, you know what I'm saying? It's not like how it used to be. Um it's not like how it used to be. There's just tons of reselling stores there. Tax crazy. Like there's like they go out of business first month that they're in because they don't they tax everything. But I mean at the same time it's like people aren't buying their shit. You know what I'm saying? They got to make a profit, so they go out of business because they have to tax. But nobody's going for the tax because you can find the same thing on whatever. So yeah, I think the reselling wave is like low key dead now. If you didn't if you didn't get it at perfect perfect moment, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of dead. But I'm hungry now. I'm about to go get some food. I think I'm gonna go get it. I don't know. Should I get Taco Bell or Chick fil A? Kind of fuck one with Taco Bell. Chick fil A. I want some chicken though. I, I always like, you know what I'm saying? Black people always want chicken. I want chicken. But I also want Taco Bell, bro. I've been, I've been feeling Taco Bell. <laughs> Now, buy some real shit, though. Motherfucker. No I got two chicken sandwiches. This is definitely the messiest. Definitely the messiest I ever, like, got Chick fil A. The bun is all soggy. It's good, though. I ain't complaining. I ain't complaining, man. All right. I'm gonna see y'all niggas.